types of spicy. The sass, the shade, the fashion. Ladies, welcome to the trend. Oh my days, oh my days. So we've got Lisa Christopherson, who is, you know, my uh, to my furthest left. And then there is Mina Karioke. I don't know why the, the cameras are not changing. All right, there we go. Hey, Mina. Hi. You can wait, you can, you can say hi. All right, so let's start off with Lisa again because they didn't see you. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Jumbo Sana. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so now, salute. Wow, look at you. Hey, look at you. Look at all of you. <laughs> Welcome to the show. Thank you. Susan, so poised. Thank so poised. So posh. Yeah, so posh. <laughs> <laughs> the posh queen. So everyone has like their title. Mm -hmm. Mina, yours is the queen of shade. Yes. I does she live? Does she? Li she lives up to it, Lisa. She yes. does, and even sometimes she, she rocks up wearing a lampshade. Yeah, she <laughs> did <laughs> rock. She <laughs> wear a <laughs> shade. The shade is she, that she much. She needs to give that to me. That she wore it for me. Yeah, it would work for you better. And what about you, Susan? You're the posh queen. Who is the posh queen? Because you also are repping for all the posh queens out Absolutely. there. It's for any woman who feels posh. Yeah, sophisticated. Doesn't do too much drama. Really? <laughs> <laughs> we do drama but in a posh way yeah yeah posh drama posh drama yeah, but we also do fashion we do lifestyle yeah we like the good life we live lavishly mm -hmm. we dress amazing mm. we're eloquent we're polished yeah. yeah i like that you said only you and sonal live this life for real for real did you mean that did you mean that susan i think she did she did mm -hmm. oh so we don't she said it. No, you've just taken it right now. Like I think we can address this that. in the next episode to be continued. You wait and see. <laughs> Thanks for <laughs> energy, darling. It's so much <laughs> wait and see. Okay, all right. So now, so now, um, you discuss spirituality on the show, mm -hmm. um, and you say that it's something that completely centers you. Tell me more about your journey. I think it grounds me in uh, many ways, like I've said on the show. Um, because uh, battling depression and anxiety, this is something that a practice that has really helped pave way for healing for, for me on this journey. Yeah. Yeah. And you try it out, I, I, not try it out, but you do a lot of dance therapy? I do Kizomba, I, yes, dance therapy. I, of course, see psychiatrists, psychologists, and mm -hmm. then I ground myself with spirituality, incense, sage, and all those good things, just to yeah. <sighs> feel zen. Yeah, so you're all about the good vibes. Yes, I am. yes. So you dressed up as Generali, I remember, and you said, you know, either you're gonna, you know, try stop make these arguments so, mm -hmm. or just. You didn't though. You no. were failing. No, I, I couldn't take it. <laughs> <laughs> you couldn't I failed. Take it. I was like, this heat is too much. I was like, anxiety, anxiety. So, like Mina said, Sonal just disappears. Girl She's comes, yeah. disappears. <laughs> so I just come and go. Yeah. I come. I see noise again. <laughs> I come, yeah. I go, but it's just to do with my anxiety. But then we knew uh, KDF is there. I call her very fondly. Yeah, we call yeah. her KDF. KDF, yeah. uh, oh, KDF. or Index oh, One. Index One. Index One. Also. Index One. Uh, yeah, 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 index what? Oh. Your index. Index One. No, she's Index One. Your Index One. Four. No, she's the youngest of them. Index One, Index Two, Index Three, Index, index four. four. The reason why uh, we called Lisa Index One is because. Akonaki Mele Mele. She mm. just likes doing everything. Wakwanza. So I, I let go. I stop the ge generally is there in me. Yeah. But I let let KDF now. KDF is uh, coming. When problems are there, KDF is there. KDF is there. Now, Lisa, uh, m people didn't know who you were. They were a bit familiar with the other faces they've been around um, on, you know, whether it's sh other shows or they've, you know, they've been seen around at events or just other media um, jobs. However, for you, this was your first time on screen, at least to us. So tell us a bit about who Lisa is. So I know you were born in Tanzania. Right? Yes, I was born on the foothills of Mount Kilimanjaro. Yeah. So grew up on West Kilimanjaro, the yeah. Shira Plateau side. And the first years of boarding school was in Arusha boarding school. And um, subsequently 12 years in Denmark there and then in Kenya. And I've been back in Kenya for about 29 years now. After traveling the world, why did you settle here? Why, why Kenya? Happen in your money. Oh! You know what? Africa's in your blood. Yeah. And, you know, third generation East African born, it's in your blood. You know, you can't find a place that is home like Nairobi. Mm. 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 Mm.
Wewe ni wa huku Sa, kabisa sana hata anashangaa wakati mimi naongea Kiswahili. Watu watu wamejaribu kukusengenya na Kiswahili. Anashangaa wanasema wewe unatoka wapi? Unatoka pwani labda sababu Kiswahili yango ni ile senefu kabisa. Yeah, so some can you speak Swahili? Yeah, of course. Oh, okay. Sana. I, oh, I said I, I got an A. Oh. Nakumbuka. Oh yes, you did say you got <laughs> an A. Yeah, you said I'm very smart. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> why why is Lisa more Kenyan than most Kenyans? Well, you know, I guess she's embraced. Uh, well, I didn't, I didn't, I think it was taken out of context. But what I was trying to say is she's very Kenyan. She's very, very Kenyan. She talks Swahili. She's, she's Kenyan, y'all, you know. So I was just trying to emphasize the fact that she's very Kenyan. Mm. And yeah. also, I'd like to say that, you know, I'm very passionate about this country. Mm. I love safaris. I grew up in the bush and I do safaris. I do beautiful bespoke safaris. I've written two guidebooks on Kenya, mm. which is like Kenya's Bible, Bush Friendly Tips for Girls, brackets, boys, just because they think they know it all. And, um, and she's always making us do all these things, these expeditions. She's like, yeah. you need to see me like Siju. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, Kenya. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Siju, we need to like, see me the <laughs> crocodiles. You, <laughs> you need to like, see Siju do like things. what? Like, I got this in Masai Mara. Yeah. I got this in Chigoni. I'm like, yeah. okay, girl. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> very and i hope you don't take this in an offensive way very caucasian every white friend i have who lives in kenya or lives in nairobi they have all of those things you know like the those from masai market yes, a lot of them, them yeah but them. i've been dealing in african tribal art for also about 30 years yeah. because oh, okay. i found it Hasn't fascinating you know yeah it is in tanzania i was introduced to the curator of the german Volkerkunde museum in berlin mm -hmm. and he gave me this coffee table book called tanzania i shangad tanzania has over 122 ethnic tribes who are they all? The culture is so rich. Mm. Kenya is the same. You know, the heritage. Okay, Everything was so made sorry, for a reason yeah, and a so purpose, <laughs> not <laughs> for commercialism. Do you know what I mean? So those plastic, you know, the little tribal stools are replaced with plastic chairs. Yeah. The beautiful tribal yeah. spears are replaced mm. with AK-47s. So for me, it's about to keep this vanishing world that's appearing too fast alive. Oh, to oh, maintain beautiful. that beautiful. culture. Yeah. I love it. I love it. That's why you're called Chewy. I guess because it's like they had no, no, no actually she's called Chewy because uh, she's always wearing Chewy something Chewy Chewy every oh, day oh, of the show. I thought it might be no. no, she, 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 she wears like Chewy no, actually. Chewy Chewy Madonna. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Madonna. It's her spirit animal. Yeah? Is that is that true? It is. It true. is. Oh, okay. Uh, but you know something tragic happened to you. Um, I think it was in 2006 and you shared it on the show and it's something that people globally um you know just are affected by whether it's directly or indirectly and that's cancer and you beat cancer stage you know, four, stage four. It's four. Not tragic things happen for mm. in a, for a reason in your life mm. i was given 10 days to live in johannesburg with on the stage four cancer and we had to get a special permit to acquire the strongest chemotherapy oral chemo in the world and that took another five days so I was losing time. But you know, when the doctors told me, I said, get on with it. I've got things to do, places to go, people to see, children to raise. Hakuna masaya kitu wingine. Twende kazi. And here I am today, 15 years later, stronger and better than ever. Yes, Yay. high five. I also want to give it around. That's <laughs> pretty big. It's really, it really, really is. Um, Mina, we are used to seeing you on single Kiasi. It's billboards everywhere, okay? And now it's billboards of, you know, Real Housewives of Nairobi. How different is it? Because this is now real. Nothing is scripted. How different is it? Um, the mic, all, the mic, baby. Oh, first of all, let's talk about. Uh, I'm the queen of shirt. I had to put it on a T-shirt. Oh, I write checks. You write <laughs> Instagram posts. <laughs> yeah. Me, me. So, uh, what did you ask again? Yes, <laughs> I am an actress. <laughs> <laughs> I've been thinking that for a minute now. Yeah. Um, how do I juggle between acting and shooting a reality show? Mm. I love shooting Ron, let me be honest, because um, shooting a reality show, I am myself. I'm not playing any other character. Single KRC, I play the role of Mariah. Mariah is a slay queen. She's nothing like me. Mm. I get to embody her character. And let me tell you, it's so stressful being on set because I've never dealt with a blesser. I've never dealt with a sponyo. I've never lived a sponsor, <laughs> you know, Why sponsored life. Laughing? No, for real. So in real life, I'm married for eight years and um, I get to play that. And it's like a safe space for me. It's a safe nest for me. Yeah. So I'd prefer doing reality. Mm. But 
being on set and embodying the other characters it's beautiful so i get to juggle it's stressful you'll see on the show that i'm actually very physically exhausted i was um, shooting single krc and run at the same time but i don't know the grace of god took me through so yeah here yeah. we are okay now i think you brought it up right so you write oh i write checks you write instagram captions now you're referencing the disagreement that you had with michelle and talami at the table which was at the end of episode one it was susan's event susan did you know that they, they had an no issue? idea i was just honestly hosting a beautiful lavish event i was shook yeah what were your thoughts about it do you did, do you think michelle you know tried and tested mine because she came and sat and she was like hi mine do you feel no, like I'm she still watching her? it right now yeah <laughs> honestly like i think i told you i'm watch i've yeah, watched it five watch times it. you know because that day things move so fast you know and when you're the host like you know things just quickly escalated and got out of hand and got mm -hmm. and, and then we moved from dr maria and Vera, remember it was by the second way. situation. Immediately. I had just like, you know, spent a day trying to make sure that everything goes well, you know, with my event planner. I mean, it was a lot of pressure for me. And then also I was getting to get to get all these fabulous ladies together. So you can imagine for me, it was like, whoa, 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 you know, yeah. it just moved. Yeah. I was and like, is this really happening? Yeah. Yeah. A lot of money. And you look great, by the way. Oh, thank thank you. you. Susan is serving. I mean, all of you are serving. All of you are serving. But that was, I think it was your day and you just looked exceptional. So, Mine, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Do, do you, you know, when Michelle came on, the, came on the table, it looked like you guys never, had never spoken before. And already there was a problem what what was tell me about just the whole experience okay, so it was susan's event at the tribe and um i was invited and i was the last cast member to be put on the show so i was getting to meet these ladies at the first time at your event mm. and um you guys don't actually see the whole thing i feel like it just it was a final edit but mm. so much was going was on and yeah. um, so i feel like michelle started poking earlier on throughout the dinner you know um and i feel like she just had something f like she just came for me like she's also like i'm coming for me nay so i had to deal with that i had to deal with her and just put her in her place i feel like she thought i was the weakest link and i thought um, maybe she thought i was an easy target um one thing i just didn't understand is why is it that we will give credit to amzungu speaking swahili but she wouldn't give credit to a kenyan speaking swahili mm -hmm. i'm kenyan Kiswahili is my national language. Nita yongia, nita isema. So I don't understand what particular reason she had to. She was like, oh, we're speaking Swahili now. I was like, yeah, we are. Actually, yes, we do. That's what we do. And I know she does. Mm. Right? So I feel like she was not being authentic. She just came in being shady. And I had to show her that I'm the queen of shade. Yes, we write checks. And she just writes her Instagram captions. Yeah. Well, you said you know a couple of other shady things as well um which of course i don't think were taken very kindly like you saying susan's perfume is fake mm. is it fake is it fake susan honestly i i buy original perfumes and they last susan's perfumes don't last so i don't know i mean it's fine like you know it was a gift you take it how you take it i gifted you a business class ticket you accepted it i gifted you a ticket to lamu you loved it so it is what it is you listen know. shooting a reality show you there are no filters you say what it is and that's what you have seen throughout the show on episode one about me i'm just being real so and i don't I'm, take it personally we are very opinionated so if i have opinion i say it okay this and i will never ever regret anything i said or take back anything i said so for me i feel like the scent was just not giving i mean my scent should last a whole day it wasn't okay all right well this is something susan you've been doing for a really long time um and like you said you and son all understand the luxury and you have been dealing in this for how long now for many years, for many I years. think you knew. Yes, we even talked, we about, talked about it. it. Yes, ah. yes. This is, <laughs> it's true. From all of these different people yeah, around yeah, the world. Yeah, yeah, So, like, you know, I mean, I I don't even have to defend myself you, on okay, that. Yeah, because, right. like, you know, everybody who knows, they know. All right. Yeah. Now, other, you know, you're also a lawyer. You don't practice, though. No, I right? don't practice. Um, and you have gone on to start, you know, so many other businesses that have flourished. Tell us a bit about your businesses. Oh wow, I think I'm an entrepreneur, but yeah. the, the, my, 
I think the biggest thing for me is Posh Palace because yeah. I love beauty. Mm. I adore making people beautiful. Yeah. I love to just see women glammed up and, you know, fabulous. Nice. Yeah. They, yeah, they say I use the word fabulous a lot. I'll say it again. <laughs> yes. fabulous. 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 And you fabulous. have two fabulous daughters. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> so you're playing with them and you're really, really close. Yeah. So I always tell this, I always tell Susan this, but her body is so insane yeah. for someone who has kids. But like, the thing is, true. like, um, people don't get it. Like, I'm a model. I've been a model my whole life, you know. And then in Kenya, guys go like, you're too skinny. You need to eat cooler, you know. Mm. And I'm like, yo, I love how I look. Yeah, you this know? is a dream. It People is. are going to hospital Everybody to get Everybody's at the done. gym, yeah. working out from morning till evening. So this is good genes. This yeah. is just good genes. So I'm Kalenjin, and then um, where we come from, we're runners, we're athletes. Yeah. So I think I'm just naturally blessed also. Unbelievable. Yeah. Okay. What do you tell your daughters? Because now there are all these cameras around. What do you tell them? I have the coolest daughters. Yeah. Um, Mia, she's 13 now. She's a big girl. She really wanted to be on the show. You know, she's just like, Mom, I really need to do this with you. She's my number one fan. Oh, you know, yeah. Okay. So she, I, at, the, at the beginning, I wasn't sure I'd bring my kids on board. But then um, she was just like, believe me, you will be amazing. We really want to do this. So I had to just, you know, say, come on. You know, let's yeah. do it. Oh. So she was game. They were game. They loved it. We had such a good time. And the thing about reality is like, like Mine and Sonal and Lisa say, it's real. Yeah. So it's we're not real. acting. I hear many people saying, oh, it's scripted. It's not scripted. No, it's not scripted. Like the same way I'm telling you today that I was very shocked at what happened. Um, it's real. And the emotions are real. Mm. Um, and the experience is real. So, you know, you're not acting. Mm. Even with my kids, it's just real. And I think it's a beautiful, crazy, insane, <laughs> wild, yeah. fun journey. Yeah. Yeah, but also, I mean, I imagine putting five different women mm. in a show. Mike? Mm -hmm. Five different women in a show. Yeah. Different personalities, different backgrounds. Yeah. Trust me, you don't need to script yeah. anything. Yeah. <laughs> 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 show it. Show it, Akuja. So now you've been very private. Um, and what you would share would be, you know, uh, shoes, right? You share your handbags, you travel. But this is this show is a bit invasive. How do you feel about about that? I think when you say private, you mean that I have not shown my children in the show. Uh, no, you generally just family. don't no. share your life. I do. I share it actually very much. No. But I share my life. Everything to do with me, mm. luxury, my work. Yes. Uh, I do share snippets of my children on Instagram here yeah. and there when it's the birthdays or things like that. Yeah. I used to share much more way Before. back okay. yes but also work has become so much with my own brand and everything yeah. that uh, let children be children i mean we each have our own opinions i do not bring mine on the show at all yeah and uh, just my preference yes but i want to uh, it's about me yeah it's about who i am yeah not just the luxury the opulence that's there that's there but the real me the fighter the warrior me mm. the vulnerable me mm. the depressed me Yes. Uh, the anxious me, the daughter, the sister, the caregiver to my mother who has cancer. Yeah. That's what you'll see. Just real me. Yeah. So I, I think I have, I have actually overshared. Yeah. That, oh, you feel like you've overshared on the you show? Watch the show. Oh, on the show. It's only episode one. You see, you guys, I don't know what else you've shared. I'm sure it's there's a lot, lot more. Does it get more explosive? Because you guys started guns blazing. And we are like, we'd, like the way you did on the show, <laughs> you were like... Tch. So it's, it's just it's about to get a crazy. It's a roller coaster. Yeah. It's, a roller coaster. Yeah. It's, it's love, it's war, it's mm. luxury, it's tears, it's, it's emotions. It's, yeah. it's a lot, Lots. but at the end of it all, Amina, mm. it's a beautiful sisterhood. Yes. How at the end of the episode, the season, when you'll see season one, the coming together of this beautiful sisterhood mm -hmm. is what I think we today are very proud of. And it's also understanding everyone. No matter who has said what, who has fought. She throws shade 24-7. Like, we, 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 we found we Lisa. We, we make, we make Jerry. more, but we, at but the end of the day, we love each other. Jerry, this is Tom, Tom, Tom and that Jerry. is Jerry. You get to me. The whole show, it's ping pong like that. And you don't even get hurt anymore. But at the end of the show, it's a sister. No, no, my fragrance. No, we fight. We've taken it personally. You find someone like me not talking to another cast member for two weeks or them. But at the end of the show is what I want to say about Nairobi, especially as 
men and women mm. is that there is a beautiful sisterhood yes. that comes together. And we are there friends, is. even yeah. And we're still friends. We are yeah. very good friends. And I love yeah. the diversity um, yeah. on the show, by the way. That was really Doesn't really matter cool. who abused whom, we're still uh, friends. Yeah. Let me just add this. Yeah. Um, being on the show is not an easy experience. Mm. It's, it grows you. In many the ways. show, I That's think we are so yeah. strong. Even when we see it's Kenyans grown-ups. talking about it, mm. we honestly, I don't think any of us cares. No, no. about no, the tro- no. trolling, about people. We have the it's thickest such of skin. a roller like coaster. Mm. We we've had to lean on each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You know, as in, these are the only women who understand so what it's, it's like. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And because of that, there's a love mm. and there's a deeper understanding it's not easy. for but each also, other. I would say there's a bond as well. Oh, for sure. You know, we spent so much time together. Yeah, actually, you know, when suddenly all ended. Like, haki na kumis. It's horrible. Like, we're so happy to be here together. We're very jobless now. Yeah. 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 You don't take things personally. Mina, did you take it personally when Lisa said that your wig is fake? She says worse things about it. She is other episodes. And it's really strange. She is not. It's only because of this wig. She is savage. We're just feeling sorry for y'all who are not entertained by this. I'm actually saying the sweetest of the ladies. No. It's so much. You may lose that bitch. Mene is nothing good. Okay. okay. I yeah. 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 Y
put six homegrown, powerful, strong women together, or like it's six lionesses, Fire. there will be war. And I think production over here did their homework. They did. Very well. Who put which six women together and watch? And each watch of us it was brought here yeah. for our And that's design. exactly what happened. Yeah. Yeah. Without any effort. It's effortless. The mm. fights, the war, the love, it's, it's effortless. Yeah. Sure. It's just there. Mm. Yeah. And we can laugh it's about well it researched. afterwards. It's we can laugh about it. Yeah. We can eat a punda. Punda ni wewe. Ni wewe. By the way, I've called my punda shikwekwe. Sonali, like Sonali's very ghetto. I've called my punda shikwekwe. How can you look at Sonali say ghetto? She is ghetto. No, if you give me ghetto, I'll give you she ten times ghetto. Yeah, she'll yeah. take you to the street. If you give me ghetto, I will give you ten times. We started off like luxury. It's okay. My punda's name is shikwekwe. I have adopted that punda. Oh my God. Yes. I know that. Is her name? Vera Shikwekwe. I saw so now. Eh, you know what? Muta ni Maliza. Muta ni Maliza. No, she like Google me. That's that's what Google says. Said so. Shikwekwe. Sedika. So my punda's name is Shikwekwe. Kuna shida. Kuni kuna shida. We're just missing Vera. Yeah. I feel like we should have been here. I feel like we should have been here. Is Michelle going no, to be a housewife? Vera said the punda has depression. Oh, who is the punda depression pills? I take them too. Oh my God. The Vera said the Punda has depression. She said that? Oh, mm. okay. okay. Is she? I think she just wants to, you know, just get it off her chest. Yeah. All right. So I don't know which Punda had depression. She's saying... No, mine. Or Next. yours. Okay. okay. Oh, gotcha. The other Punda, she's not coming back. And she's not a housewife. Who is the other Punda? The one you just... Mm. Before when I asked, is Michelle mm. coming... Is she going to be a housewife? Well, we don't get to decide. Oh, you don't we also decide. didn't get to decide. No, on season one, she's not a housewife. She's not. Okay. Too. Yeah. All right. Okay. So... Do you guys get to decide? Who? No. no we okay. Don't. We don't. How was the we casting just process? Met at we the, don't at my party, like they, you they saw decide. the introductions. Right? Oh, that was the actual introduction. Yeah. For real yeah. Like we were auditioned last year. Yeah. yeah. Made last year. So they they used they came to our houses. They do a profile introduction. Correct. Something. And then they just got to decide. They yeah. auditioned a lot of women in Nairobi, by it's the not way. Scrutiny. They take their time, then they decide who they want. Yeah. Them. And it's about your personality and your lifestyle. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think people will know about you on the show that they have not seen in any other platform? Um, I'm married. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 I'm mean, they get to see a very. A uh, my side. marriage is very organic, and that's what you get to see on the show. Yeah. It's not fake. I could I could just do a reel for one minute, and it's just because. We need to do a reel mm. for social media. Mm. So my marriage is very organic and you get to see that. I'm a mother. Mm. Yeah, I have two beautiful daughters. One that is my bonus daughter and one that is my biological daughter. And also I am fierce and you do not joke with me, Neke. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You said, uh, How is he taking this whole thing? I mean, he's no... He's, he's no stranger to the to the industry mm. but then this is also a different side I mean it's our lives this mm. is our real life for people's entertainment so to speak mm. um, how is he handling that um, actually he's the one who's like babe go for it yeah. I, I was not so sure I wanted to do a reality show because I also was shooting single Kiasi and he was like babe let's do this you do this this is good for you this is who you are you were born to do this mm. I feel like he's a very supportive man He's, he's very supportive. People don't understand that. Lisa was like, yo, you're very, you're very African, Kikuyu, but you're so supportive. Mm. And, and he's my friend. And just like your friend will do, support yeah. you. That's what he does. Yeah. And I feel like um, I'm, very, I'm a very bold and confident you know, human being. And he's, he's known that. And that's one thing that really attracted him to me. So he's like, yeah, show the world who you are. Mm -hmm. yeah. So yeah, he's good. He's good. I I love yeah, Pierre's on the show. He was actually saying, that for him as a Kikuyu man, that he wants to support his alpha female Aww. woman. Aww. And that was amazing. Yeah. yeah. In fact, you told me before the show when I was asking you about the whole fake wig. Was it? No, you said cheap wig. Yeah, cheap Lisa. Hey, Lisa. I told you. Savage. Well, le, 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 le. I told you. you said you even she looked cheap. I did because, you know, I have seen Mine with her natural hair yeah mm. short beautiful and i said they thought how can such a beautiful woman cover this beauty up with these wigs kwanza they're dangerous if they catch fire we're all burned <laughs> <laughs> you are so fire. Fire. You're you're right. Right. <laughs> so, so 
Jason, what, are, what, what? Why should people tune into the show? <laughs> well, because it's funny. Yeah, it's, really it's relatable. Fun. I feel like all the Kenyan women can relate to one of us. Yes. There's another Lisa out there. You'll, you'll mm -hmm. watch Mine and go like, I'm as shady as she is. You'll watch Generali and you'll go like, yeah, what a classy babe. You know, mm -hmm. you'll watch me and just go like, she's insane. You know, so, <laughs> I mean, you, we are all relatable. Yes. But at the end of the day, you can, you can identify with us. We will distract you. We'll make you laugh. We'll show you our lives. We are unapologetic. We are vulnerable. We are human. And we're not afraid to be human. We have yes. let you into our lives. And I think it, we become even more vulnerable as the show continues. Yeah. Yeah. Episode one is nothing. Nothing I compared promise to the last year. Year. I Yeah, we, we grew. We, we grew. grew. Oh, oh we have show. so grown. As you can see. Yeah, I see it. We grew. Can, can we talk about the fashion real quick before we go? Yeah. You all looked exceptional. Was there like a stylist you know, for every like how was it each one has their own but yeah you the can fashion have your stylist i worked with kayla okari shout out to kayla yeah, yeah she's kayla. my girl she's amazing i mean the show moves very fast you know i mean i yeah. have lots of clothes on my clock but you know mm -hmm. I, you would prefer for somebody to help you mm -hmm. panga yourself because the show is very fast moving sometimes yeah. you have Something to change two times yeah. a day right yeah. 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 yes yeah i also look like my stylist kanazi she did a good Good job. Good job. I am my stylist. Yes. Right. So am I. <laughs> Uh, you guys, you know, this is so interesting. I can never style myself, so it's very uh, my impressive. own makeup yeah. artist and my it's stylist. It's too fast moving. My own makeup. You do it all? Style. Yes, today even my makeup. But we do have a stylist who helps us with when we're the diaries. Diaries. Yeah. Yeah. diaries. Yeah, that is nice. done by production. Yes. 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 Yeah. Nice. Shout out, out to Amanda. Mm. Yes. Uh, yes. Yeah. Amanda uh, did a great job. Diaries. Diaries. All confessionals you will see is Amanda. Yeah. yeah. She did a okay. great job. So, uh, you know, a lot of the times, this is going to be my last question, a lot of the times when it comes to reality TV, people don't want to see the sweet and the nice and the kind. Mm. That's not what they're looking mm. for. They're, That's, looking for they're tuned in for the drama. Yeah. Do you feel like then that already makes you, you're just pitted against one another already? That's what people want to see. Do you feel like there's any kind of... You know what I mean? Where they I think it does. Yeah. Uh, like coming into the show, because I think I was the most like clueless. So mm. I was just like, huh, ah, we'll just keep it classy and nice. <laughs> Mine was, I was like, wait, <laughs> you know, what is happening? So, you know, it moves so fast. Yeah. I think by episode um, three, you kind of get it, you know. Yeah. And not even that, it kind of becomes fun. Mm. It's no longer so really scary. Yeah, don't worry it's about no the longer. And the then mics. also you get used to the people. It's unfiltered. In the show. Um, mm -hmm. It's no longer shocking, but it's very shocking in the beginning. Yeah. yeah. And then you get used to it after a while. Yeah, yeah you I don't know. I mean, you embody it. No, 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 like like so for me, it was nothing new. Like, <laughs> in my life. I mean, obviously, how she came, she just landed and she was like, let's she was like go. ready. Us guys yeah. are like, you know, we're business people. <laughs> I'm like, what is not happening here? Your mic, you baby. Know? Your mic. Oh, yeah, yeah. So yeah. 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 I'm used to cameras. That was That's my life. Yeah. I mean, when you Raisha. Who do you think is the queen of the show? Is everyone a queen on the show? Everybody's sure. a queen. Okay. Everybody's a That's queen. That's why our taglines are the way they queens. are. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yes, because everyone is different. I am the posh queen. queen. She's posh generally. Queen. Queen. Yeah. She's Shady a queen of queen. shade. She's chewy. Chewy, chewy. chewy. <laughs> Lisa, we have to find <laughs> her another name. You have to be queen chewy, of stuff. She loves being chewy, chewy. Uh, oh, just chewy, mm, chewy. Yeah. Not the queen of the chewies no. or something. No, you can also be queen chewy, of rally. Chewy. Yeah. Oh, yes, the queen of the rally. And you have a rally coming up, by the way. So, uh, yes, I have. I'm really hoping to be able to be part of WRC this year. So, in the KNRC uh, category. So, we're out there empowering women to enter into the motorsports field of Kenya. I found the all female Lioness Rally. So I'm really hoping that we can raise funds. We're looking for sponsors. We are Billboard on Wheels that can support us and ensure that we get into this rally this year in three months' time. Yeah, I wish you all the very best, and I hope it does happen. What time is the show? I know it's on Thursday, but what time is it? 6 p.m. I can't believe we have to wait a so. whole week. A whole yes. week. It's just Six no, days. No, it drops seven. in the morning. Yeah. Actually, we yeah. don't know. It I, drops. I thought yesterday at 6 p.m., but I Jen, don't Jen is here. Jen. It premiered at 6 p.m. It premiered at 6 p.m., but we don't know. It's okay, Jen, just say it. Oh, that is just the first Oh, okay. okay. We don't know. Yeah. So, Thursday, Thursday. 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 Thurs
So oh, you can sit on work. sofa. Okay, you can, you can skip Just work. don't go to work. Or is it? <laughs> oh, I know. Watch it all day. You gotta do what you gotta yeah, do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. worth it. Yeah. I promise you. <laughs> episode two is lit. Yeah, I feel like, like it's not long enough. No, no, you guys should make it like an hour, like a movie. Right? Yes. Yes, you should. Jenny, show Max. Thank you. Thank you so much. Anything else you guys want to add? Well, I would just, I would just like to say that Nairobi has been received very well by Africa. We have the housewives from Cape Town, from Durban from like Abuja like mm -hmm. Africa is the loving best franchise yes. Yes. hands yeah. down and even Bravo is really excited um, and so we're proud of us but yeah. also one thing I'd like to say since we're here is that this would not have been possible without the amazing team at DNR, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, they they were Carol, Carol Carol and the team no the whole team from from the Carla. highest director producer to mm, the smallest the cameraman runners, to the boomer sound. sound i mean it would not have been possible yeah. to let see my be looking so beautiful yes, i'm so really they made us, they so made us yeah. look that way we and had some famous it's a it's a, it's a team it's a she it's team we, we were treated like queens I say, yeah, yeah i mean i respected the most with the team they worked as a team and they kept time oh for sure if i called she said she needed 6 a.m they were there and we there. had emotional support psychological yes. support on set ambulances okay. on set i mean yeah. they, they held us going through these days they held us yeah. yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. they had a psychiatrist and it is going to be sharing something on the yeah. show yeah. as well and susan as well and everyone really gets so to open up teamwork. and if you're ever yeah. uncomfortable so they would back you up and that's yeah. why all of us here are excited mm. for season two yeah for the i don't I think it. we have anybody who's feeling uh, a bit shaky about season no. two despite and all the drama despite all the drama, drama. I mean, and a big shout you can, out you can to say. carol specifically because and you carol, can say carol has never is ever looked that good never Carol is, is young. Like she's a director on the yeah. show. She's the, she owns Real Housewives. She's really put she's it together. She's been amazing. Eugene and kept it together. Shout yeah. out to the entire team. Yeah. Yeah. DNR is good job. Good, yes. yeah. good job. Thank you very much, ladies. You can catch them every Thursday as they entertain, as they inspire you, as they <laughs> make you laugh, shade. as they throw shade. <laughs> but they do it with class and yes. elegance. I don't know how the other episodes are going to go. Is someone going to be throwing a glass of champagne? I don't know. I, I don't know what's going on. But you can watch it, of course, on Showbacks. Thank you so much to Jen. Thank you to Eugene Bugua, DNR Studios. Yes. That's formerly Young Rich Television. They have done an exceptional job. This yes. definitely impressed everybody even if you are a natural born hater and you just hate kenya <laughs> and you hate nairobi and, and you, you hate, hate suzanne and me you cannot hate the show that's how good it is yes. we have to take a quick break when we get back elizabeth lenger will be in studio talking all about ip if you're a content creator you don't want to miss that we'll be back after this thank you so much ladies hey yeah. i've enjoyed myself so happy. it was right i feel like it was such a like a calm conversation